You want to say hi, Moose? And Ashley. Oop, there they are. <laughs> hi, guys. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Frances. I am a full time reseller on eBay and Poshmark. And it has been. <laughs> It has been quite the week. Um, I usually put out more videos than I have been. And uh, <laughs> as you can probably tell from my voice, I am sick or I'm getting over sickness. Um, last Friday, I tested positive for COVID and I was so, so sick for like three days. And then I kind of got my energy back and I've been kind of just trying to get over the sickness uh, since then. <clears throat> I still haven't gone anywhere. So this haul is from like two weeks ago, really. I've, I just have been keeping it, um, meaning to film, but haven't been feeling well. So today I actually feel better. My voice sounds worse than how I actually feel. Um, so <laughs> yeah, I, I'm okay to film a video. I just sound really bad. But anyways, so this haul is from, like I said, about two weeks ago. I just had it in my car. Um, yeah, I can't remember how much I paid and I don't remember how many pounds it was. It was so long ago. I honestly don't remember. I really want to go back to the bins, but obviously I have to wait for my quarantine to be up. Um, so yeah, just trying to stay healthy and not, you know, get anyone else sick. Anyways, so it's good to be back. <laughs> and I'm sorry if my voice is really annoying. It's annoying me. Um, but yeah, let's just kind of, let's just get into the haul. So, uh, a lot of this stuff I don't remember even grabbing at the bins. Honestly, it's been that long. But yeah, this will be fun to kind of relive and I can, you know, get some listings up while I'm laying in bed trying to feel better. So yeah, thank you all, all of you guys for your um, messages. I really do appreciate that. I, I have been feeling better. So anyways, let's get started. <laughs> this is an Eileen Fisher um, size XL. Um, this is like an open knit kind of um, tunic length top. So it is a uh, linen blend and it's like a long tunic, short sleeve top, really cute. Um, I'll probably list, well, okay, so I did look this one up and it retailed for like $215, $215, which is, you know, insane, but we all know Eileen Fisher is super expensive retail. I'll probably list it around $45 or $50, not expecting it to sell for that much, but you know, just starting price. Um, and I am open to offers, but sorry, getting texts. Um, and yeah, so that's a really nice piece. Um, good for summer. <clears throat> this is a J Crew. Uh, it's a regular J Crew, not factory size zero. And I don't know why I grabbed this. I think it's kind of cute, I guess. It's like a little strapless dress, lace dress. Um, I just feel like this kind of stuff is really good for summer, like, parties um yeah like a party guest there's um zip in the back it's just kind of cute and it's actually super lightweight this one is from let's see what year this one's from 2016 so I mean it's not super old it's not super new though <laughs> um I thought that was cute also right when I got COVID I thought I would be able to you know take so many photos of my death pile and list all my death pile but no that is not what happened I was just in bed for days uh like I didn't even have energy to list stuff on my phone which yeah that was really rough <laughs> I was just watching tv pretty much the whole time okay this is a bolo brand I don't know if it's not super popular but I think a lot of people may know it um it's called American Giant and it's a size small. I, I f couldn't figure out if this was unisex or what it was. I mean, it could be unisex, but I did look up the style and it is women's. So uh, this brand makes a lot of like sweatshirts and sweatpants, things like that. Really heavy, nice cotton material. It's supposed to be super comfy and uh, it's really expensive. So I'm going to list this for probably $40 to $50. It is just a sweatshirt, but yeah, this stuff 
that brand is really, really nice. So, um, you know, happy to find that. Um, okay. These are a pair of Everlean jeans. That is the tag and that's the little back tag. These are a size 28 regular and they are just a like kind of mid to high rise black jean. They're super stretchy. Um, like they feel like they would be super comfortable. I don't have a pair of Everlane jeans of my own, but they do look really comfortable. Um, they don't, you know, Everlane doesn't actually retail for a whole lot unless you get like a cashmere wool sweater, but like their jeans, I think they're just like $68 or something, but I think you can usually get like 25 to 30 for them. So, uh, at the bins, I will still grab Everlane. Um, okay, this is We the Free, so free people. Um, this is a super, super cute little tank top. Probably didn't retail for too much, but it's super cute. And kind of has like an asymmetrical hem, <clears throat> as you can see. Uh, this is a size medium, and yeah, it's actually really cute kind of want to keep that but we'll see <laughs> um okay next is oh yeah this I remember grabbing this pardon my sniffles sorry I know it's super gross super unattractive <laughs> um okay this is Athleta says large and this is a striped like gray black white little athletic skirt it's actually really nice and it has these uh, zipped pockets. It does have like a lining thing. So I think you this would be a skirt. It's really stretchy. Um, super cute. Like 28 probably dollars. Something like that. Um, yeah, really cute. I love finding Athleta. Okay. Ah, this is a Madewell size small. And this is a, like a tiered sleeve white sweater. This is a wool blend. Um, I think this would be considered like a wide neckline, like a boat neck maybe, something like that. Um, I'll have to look that up, but yeah, this is in super good condition. There's no flaws really, unless I find one, but yeah, super cute. Wool blend, probably more of a fall winter item, but you know. It'll come, <laughs> fall will come sooner than we think. So, you know, hopefully that'll sell. Okay, this is Urban Outfitters Out From Under, size large. It's actually just a cute little striped crop top thing. And the sleeves are kind of like a dolman style. Like that. <clears throat> um, really cute. You know, super lightweight. So even if I make 10 or 15 on that, I'm you know, I didn't pay very much for it and it's still a good return. Um, so yeah, really cute. Okay. This is one of my favorite bread and butter brands. This is J Jill. And, um, this is a size extra small petite. It is just, you know, nice sweater, it's super basic, but you know, I just think it's really just nice. I wish this was my size, but I'm not an extra small petite, but somebody out there is that will probably, hopefully, want this sweater. Uh, okay. Next. Ah, I'm like pulling multiple things out at once. Oh, these were so, so cute. I wish these were my size. So these are Levi's uh, High Waisted Straight. And they're a blue jean with like distressing, super high rise, straight leg jean. I thought this style was so cute. I don't pick up every pair of Levi's that I find because all well, of the styles aren't actually worth that much, but these were sold at uh, Urban Outfitters and I think maybe Aritzia, I'll have to double check, but usually that's a good sign. Um, So yeah, these I can probably get 40 to 45 for. I mean, I'll have to look up comps, of course, but that's a really good style. Um, okay, really cute piece. This is a Madewell size, small, little lightweight cardigan. I thought this was actually just super, super cute. Again, <laughs> this is my size. 
I love uh, dusters. I don't think this would fit me. No, it's a little tight on the arms. Um, uh, but super cute. Yeah, so small. So really good condition. It's really hard to stand for this long. <laughs> uh, but I've been laying in bed way too much. So um, I will. I'll rest after this. Don't you worry. Um, okay, this is Anthropology Maeve size four. Um, this is super cute. This is a, has like safari animals all over it. I just thought this was adorable. Little button front blouse. Um, and yeah, did I say size four? Really, really cute. I love this print so much. Um, up close little elephants and lions and what are those called? Um, what's that animal called? Shoot, I don't know. Oh, also, the worst thing about COVID. I lost my taste and smell, and I literally can't taste anything. It's the worst thing. Can't smell either, but the tasting part is worse because, like, I was drinking coffee earlier because I am addicted to coffee, and it literally tasted like hot water. <laughs> I was like, this is terrible. Like, I can't even enjoy anything. So, that sucks. Anyways. These are so cute. These are American Eagle uh, Distressed Jeans. This is their newer tag, or uh, not, it's not really a tag. Their newer logo, because it doesn't say Outfitters under there. You know it's newer. It has Distressing. This is the Highest Rise Mom Jean in a size 12. And what, I'm trying to figure out like what year it's from, but I, can't figure that out. <laughs> uh, these are really cute. Yeah, newer style kind of. Okay, <clears throat> this is a Torrid size two X. This is a seashell printed little blouse, and it does have like I don't know if you can see that because it's sheer, but there's some like little ruffles down the front. Short sleeve sheer blouse, so cute. Yeah. That one. Ah! I'm a mess. My light is falling. Um, Alright, this is a um, Hannah Anderson size 6 to 7 little chambray dress. It has little ruffle sleeves. So cute. Yeah, I like picking up little Hannah Anderson dresses. Um... I mean, the return isn't that great, but I just think they're cute. <laughs> okay, this is another Eileen Fisher. This is a size 1X, so that's a good size. Um, and they are viscose nylon and spandex. They're a pair of, like, white kind of ivory color pull-on pants. Um, so not super substantial, but definitely can't leave these behind. Super you know, good staple piece. So I thought those were cute. Um, okay. This is Zara size small. And I got this because first of all, this style is just really cute. Like, come on, that's just adorable. <laughs> Little cable knit kind of, uh, sweater vest, but also it is a wool blend. So I thought that added to the value a little bit, hopefully. Okay, this is by far my favorite piece. I just think this is adorable. And I do actually have this one listed already. This is Free People Beach, size small. And it is a like a knit dress, beach cover-up kind of dress, and it's maxi length. I just thought this was really adorable. Um, yeah, I was surprised it actually doesn't retail for as much as like I thought it would. I think it's like $70. Um, but I think the Free People Beach line is just not as high, like, tier? I don't know. But I thought that was adorable. Um, and then this actually already sold. So I listed these around the same time. They are, like, very similar colors. Um, yeah, this sold already. So this is Free People, um, Intimately Free People, says XL. So, good size. Um, this is a dress I found maybe 15 times. It's, like, so classic. It's called, like, the Voila Trapeze Dress or something like that. 
has like a <laughs> lace uh, striping. And yeah, it's kind of like a midi length. Really love this pink color. And I think this sold for $22, something like that. So I will put this over here. Yeah, really, really quick sale. I listed that last night and it sold last night. Uh, this is a... Oh, <laughs> I can hear my dog. This is a Denim and Supply Ralph Lauren top. This is a, like a little floral printed, the, or floral printed top. The neckline is actually really stretchy. Okay, next is this brand, which I will pick up this brand if it is super flawed, no matter what. Um, this is Smart Wool size medium, and... This brand is just so expensive and people wear this as a base layer. So there is a hole on the front, as you can see, but that doesn't bother me. It'll just sell for less, but um, for base layers, a lot of times people don't really mind that. Um, and you can still get a good return even when there's flaws. So <laughs> I picked it up. Um, this is kind of another base layer. This is Toad & Co size large. It's like a striped hooded long sleeve top. It's actually super cute. Kind of just uh, has thumb holes, so it's nice. Nice, like, athletic top. That was cute. Okay, and then I found this hat. Can't tell if it's kids or women's or what. Um, Patagonia. And there's no tag. The tag is, like, cut out in the inside, so it can't tell. <laughs> but... I feel like it might be, a, I don't know, kind of seems like maybe a kid's, uh, dark blue kind of hat, but it could also be adult. I don't, I don't know. Let me know if you're interested. <laughs> it's really cute. Uh, yeah, a little Patagonia hat. And then this is a Citizens of Humanity Rocket Ankle mid rise Skinny Jean. This size 28. Really cute light wash with kind of like a little bit of a distressed hem and a button fly exposed button fly i really like that thought these were kind of cute okay i think that'll be the end of this haul video <laughs> it was all the energy that i could put in for the day so i really wanted it to be longer i do have some more stuff but i will just have to show that in the next video so thank you guys so so much for watching i really hope you enjoyed please give me a thumbs up and subscribe and i'll see you in my next video bye